These images have sent shockwaves through Taiwan. Three plainclothes officers chased down a local teenager, the son of a Vietnamese immigrant. They say they believed he was a runaway migrant worker, but the 17-year-old was on his way to work on a relative's farm. During the arrest, he thought he was being kidnapped. In the scuffle that follows, the teenager's head hits a piece of farm equipment. This left a gash across his face that needed 17 stitches. The incident happened in early July, but it was kept under wraps until a Zhanghua County Council member went public last week. It's left many local residents feeling upset and angered. After public outcry, all three officers involved now face sanctions and an investigation from the local prosecutor's office. But activists say this is not an isolated incident. NGO Taiwan Association for Human Rights says people of Southeast Asian descent often face harassment and violence from the country's police. The association says this is a systemic problem. And they say that without a fundamental overhaul in how the police are instructed and trained, the case in Zhanghua won't be the last of its kind. John Su and John Van Trieste for Taiwan Plus.